Good morning, guys. It's Vlogmas day eight, and right now I'm getting ready to go to work. But I really like have no desire to go. Like, you ever just wake up and you're in like one of those moods where you just don't want to do anything? That's me right now. Like, I just want to lay in my bed all day and do nothing. I don't know why. Like, I'm just like, blah. And not that I'm like sick. You ever get like, I don't know, you ever just get into one of those moods that you're just like, ugh. I don't know how to explain it, but yeah. Um, but hopefully I'll get into a better mood once I get to work, just because Carrie will be there. Um, I wonder if Kyle's working today. Let me go look. I love working with Kyle because, like, he really is amazing. Love that kid. Oh, Kyle's literally working at 1.30. It's so annoying. But, um... Yeah, usually when I work with Kyle, he, like, I could literally be so sad and he'll just cheer me up. He's literally the bestest ever. And, yeah, and also, um, hopefully I'll get into a better mood because we're going out by Erin, my friend Erin. You guys will probably see her in the vlog tonight. We're celebrating her birthday, so we're going to go out by her. She lives, like, way out east. If you guys are from Long Island, you know what that is. I have work at 1030! Um, yeah, so that'll be fun. We're going out to dinner and I think we're drinking, so we love it. And yeah, my hair really needs to get done. Like, do you see how bad my roots are? It's crazy. But yeah, today's going to be probably a boring vlog day. Maybe I'll get, do like a get ready with me. That'd be fun. I need to ask Erin though how she wants us to dress because I don't know if she wants us to dress like chill, casual, or like, you know, nice. Don't know. So, yeah, I'm going to go finish getting ready for work and then I'll probably talk to you guys when I get home later. So, peace. Also, I just wanted to show you guys quick the shoes that I normally wear to work. And they are my orange Crocs. I literally love Crocs so much. I actually have another pair. I'll show you. I'll show you. These were my first pair of Crocs that I had. I mean, besides when I was, like, younger, I had, like, light pink ones. But these, they're, like, this blue. And we, me and my friend Megan bedazzled them, and my dog ate them. As you could see, the giant, the other holes in it that aren't supposed to be there. <laughs> um, thanks, Domino. I'm trying to get these in my closet. Um, we bedazzled them for like our dance competitions for dance we would always wear them and now we just we always wear them anywhere we go but they're mostly for um like anything dance related which is fun and cute we have matching ones and everybody always makes fun of us but obviously we don't really care so yeah that's why I have these orange ones and the next color I want to get is yellow Honestly, I want all the colors, but we gotta calm down there. So, yeah. If you guys don't have Crocs, I suggest you guys get them. I should literally be freaking sponsored by Crocs. Mm. I tell everybody that they need to get them, and I'm convinced Megan and I brought Crocs back. We got Crocs our senior year of high school, and we wore them to school, and people were like, what the hell? Like, what is going on? And that was probably... I don't, what, what did some, some kid tweeted about one of us, like, saw one of us walking in the hallways and was like, who's seen that girl on the blue Crocs? And it was just so funny. People were like, look at us, like, what the hell is on that girl's feet? But now all of a sudden people like Crocs. So, you know what? I'm just convinced that Megan and I brought them back and that's a fact. So, hi. So I got home from work about like an hour and a half ago but I was laying in my bed and I realized that when I rearranged my room I have an outlet under here that outlet right so I have that light plugged into it and I have that one um and then I realized that it's only two two of the things so I was like oh crap like where am I going to 
put my like straightening iron and curling iron when I need them. So then I move this dresser, because there's an outlet back there. I don't even know if I'm showing you guys because the viewfinder's up. But, like, that's annoying if I have to pull out the dresser every time I want to do my hair. So now I don't know what to do, because this cord right now for this mirror doesn't really reach. So I might have to get, like, an extension cord or something, but... Whatever, I guess we're just going to have to make do for today and then figure it out. And yeah. I have no idea what I'm even wearing. I don't know how I'm going to do my makeup. All I know is I need to get ready quickly because we're leaving at 5.30. And it's 4.30 now. So that's really great. Okay. So I'm hungry. I'm going to stop recording. I'm going to let this straightening iron heat up gonna go shove something down my throat because I'm starving and I'm like about to eat my arm so that's good but we don't want to do that because we're you know yeah I don't know I'm losing my mind so talk to you guys in a tad sorry about this thing right here it's the box and it has a little sunflower on it but in case you're wondering why it's so dark back there um I had to turn my regular light off because um what happened I have to turn it off because I think the light bulb is like not the right one. I think it has, I don't know, my dad was telling me but I don't remember. But pretty much it smells like it's burning so I, I had to turn it off because it was freaking me out. So whatever, thank god I have these two big lights which it could, honestly, I still kind of smell the burning but not that it's my hair because I smelled it before I started doing my hair but... It might be that big lamp, but I never had a problem with it before, so I don't really know why I would start doing it now. Um, but yeah, I feel like this lighting is so weird. Like, I feel like this is, like, something you see when people are getting interviewed in, like, those, like, murder shows. Like, cold case or whatever the heck it's called. I don't know. I don't even know what I'm saying, but I got myself chips and went downstairs and got the kettle cooked Lay's. And... If you've never tried those guys, you need to go try them ASAP. These. They're so good. I love the kettle cooked ones so much better than the regular chips. Because I like how crunchy they are. And yeah, right now I'm straightening my hair. Um, nothing special to it. I literally just put the flat iron and brush it through after because... Like, I don't know how people touch their hair literally right after the hot, the iron comes off of it. Because I burn my hand so much that I could cry. So people who are able to touch a flat iron milliseconds. Milliseconds? Yeah. Whatever. As soon as you're done using it, congrats to you. Because I don't even know what I'm saying. Honestly, just... Just stop, just stop listening to me. Just exit out of this video because I have no idea what I'm doing with my life. But, yeah, I'm trying to figure out like what kind of makeup I want to do. I think I'm just going to do like um something brown, basic. Because I think I'm going to wear all black. But I don't know. And how does everybody else straighten their hair? I'm asking my friends because, again, nobody wants to watch me. But you know what? It's okay. I'll vlog for my friends because I know they like it. So shout out to my friends who support me. I just wish this camera didn't chop off half my head. Like, see, I have a big clip. I don't really know what else to place under the camera. I wonder if you guys can hear me crunching. That'd be cool. Because then that means you can hear how crispy they are. <clears throat> but I'm going to turn the camera off now. And I'll talk to you guys when I'm done straightening my hair. Because this is now three and a half minutes. And it's just of me talking about I don't even know what. So, Alright, so I finished my hair. Look how fabulous. Just kidding. It's actually it didn't come out that good. 
I don't really know why, but I think I'm gonna end up wearing it in like a low back ponytail anyways. Um, but now I'm about to do my makeup. Let's try and finesse this, am I right guys? I need to go put ocean on my face. Oh wait, actually, you know what I have? Eyelash I have this. Face primer I got in my Ipsy bag. So let's give this a whirl. Are you supposed to like moisturize your face first? Do that anyways. All right, hold up. Hold up, wait a minute. Okay. I don't like that you can't see me. I don't know what to do about that, but whatever. Um. What was I doing? Oh, the face primer. Let's try this sucker out, right? I don't really know how much you're supposed to put on. I'm not really a makeup girl, but. are weird. I never put face primer on before because I never had one. What's it supposed to do? Are you not supposed to put moisturizer on if you put on a face primer? Oh, I think it smooths out your skin. Is that what it does? That's what it does, guys. Let me know because that's interesting to me. But I feel like it's definitely <laughs> gonna make me break out like crazy. So that will stink. If that happens. I also got this in my Ipsy bag. This. Makeup Forever. It's an invisible coverage foundation. I never tried it, but I'm kind of scared to try it. And where is it? honey all right i'm not recording this tonight sorry guys i need music to get ready it'll help me get ready faster but yeah so i'll show you guys what i do after okay guys we're out here and where are we for erin's birthday there's carrie there's becky becky has a youtube channel too so I everybody do. i will leave the link yeah, I will. <laughs> now we're gonna go eat our big butts off. Really? No, mine's a Sony or Samsung. Mine's not a Canon. Oh. <laughs> <laughs>